2020 Honda Goldwing Tour DCT Test Review There are a lot of elements of the 2020 Honda Goldwing Tour DCT that can define it but it is perhaps the 103 pound-feet of torque that does it best. And it's not just that there is 103 pound-feet. No, it's that this torque peak happens at about 1,400 rpm. And, in fact, torque is more than 100 pound-feet from 1,000 rpm to 3,500 and gently tapers off as it approaches its 6,400 rpm rev limiter. Put it this way, at idle rpm, the gold wing makes more torque than most production motorcycles on the market. Add to this the horsepower that builds in a nearly perfect straight line as rpm rises. See the dyno video and test report here, this is a kind of internal combustion effortlessness that informs every movement of the gold wing, particularly because the horizontally opposed six-cylinder is so smooth. Even at 845 pounds with its 5.6-gallon fuel tank full, as measured on the CW scale, the gold wing is fingertip easy to control when in motion. The reverse and forward walking control mode means also that even fully loaded and two up, the rider can use the plus and dash dual clutch transmission manual shift buttons to maneuver the bike with confidence and ease. And paddling around parking lots is fine, but it's not where the wing shines. If you said I had to ride three consecutive 1,000-mile days on the gold wing, I'd say, when do I get to start? Hopefully, you'd say, as soon as you click the 7-speed DCT automatic transmission into drive. For those with a religious affiliation to manual clutches and towing a shift lever, shift on, my friends. I mean, I love having great clutch control and using my brain to perfectly rev-match downshifts. I enjoy riding two up with my wife or son and deftly modulating clutch and throttle for the smoothest possible departure and seamless shifts so we never knock helmets or experience any other untoward lurching. But I can't tell you how much I enjoy letting DCT do all of that for me through excellent mapping in any of its riding modes. There is Sport, which is Honda showing off how edgy it can be, and Econ, which is so stubbornly frugal it shifts into seventh gear at about 41 miles per hour. Rain does the obvious, and tour was the mode of choice.